Come bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, you that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary and bless the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth give to you his blessing out of Zion. Thus may the Lord Almighty, our God and Saviour, grant to us a quiet night and a perfect end, for our help is in the name of this Lord, who made the heavens and the earth. As we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness. And so together we say, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us, by your Spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. With the confidence that our requests are answered, we say together, before the ending of this day, Creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. But before we sleep, we long to hear from God in his word. And tonight we listen to Psalm 143 verses 10 to 12, which reads, Teach me to do your will. For you are my God. May your good spirit lead me on level ground for I am your servant David was going through a tough time when he wrote this psalm but though he longed for the Lord to destroy his enemies he was more concerned to be faithful to his God for that reason he sought divine wisdom and fellowship over all else. Lord God, we too are your servants, ready to respond to your voice and to do your will. But, Lord God, subdue our enemies too. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. So may the Lord our God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit bless us and watch over us. May the Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. May the Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. <laughs>